Hey guys, what's up? Y'all know how bad I want two SG Ninja Wright mowers. Well, guess what? Now it's your chance to buy your own. Just go to sgninjas at gmail.com. Let Sensei Nick know that you want one, two, or a whole fleet of these things. And he's going to send that email off to Wright for you. Guys, don't miss your chance. I'll see ya. Hey guys, what's happening? Wow, what a day. So, I am on my sixth yard of the day. I wanted to show you guys, I told you I would, the mulch job that Justin and Jackson did the other day. So here it is. Man, they did a good job. Check this out. Just going to show you some of it. And you'll see other parts of it in the footage. Obviously, we still have to trim the hedges, but that will happen next month. Looks wonderful. I tell you, man, this guy, they really do a good job, those guys. So, you can see the edging a little bit. Anyway, whew, we got a lot to do today. The truck is not fixed. When you back up and turn the wheel, it still has a clunk in it. So we have to take that back in tonight and drop it off. We are going to get severe thunderstorms tomorrow and Thursday, which, you know, it amazes me because it seems like it hasn't rained at all this year. I don't know. I think we do need rain. That's that's the one that's the one key element we're missing is rain. We've got the wind, we get a little sun, we've got heat, cold. It was 48 degrees this morning. Unreal. Anyway, whew, hope you guys enjoyed all the new equipment. Not going to use it till next year. I'm just looking ahead. We're getting a little bit ahead, so figured I'd go ahead and buy it now. Uh, there was something I wanted to talk about today, but I can't remember, so maybe I'll, maybe it'll come to me. Anyway, got the belt back on the skag, it's working good. You know, I'm just going to call it a scabber, what the heck. Don't give me too much heat, come on, it's a joke, man, it's a mower, it works fine, nobody cares, sorry. So let's go to work, get some uh, footage of these next uh, five yards, and I'm going to go home after that and shave my nappy face, see if uh, Dr. Real can clean himself up, and uh, we'll go from there. Let's go to work. Okay guys, I got this one done. I'll show you the after. Well, I think it looks really nice. The back stripes up pretty decently. The front, not as much, obviously. But, uh, well, Justin did a great job. So did Jackson. Oh man, 
and there was mulch left over so what I had Justin do was knock on the next door neighbor's house or door and they ended up putting the rest of the mulch in here so sometimes you got to think outside of the box when you got mulch sitting there with no place to put it oh anyway we're gonna go on to the next one and I do have an update on Justin um, not good but uh, just stay tuned for that let's go to the next one I'm gonna try to get as much footage of this yard as I can and I've had some people ask me how do you blow beds out so I'm gonna show you on this Justin just mulched this yesterday it's starting to rain which is kind of weird because we haven't had any rain this year and uh, but let me get started here and uh, hopefully I can show you how I do it <laughs> Alright guys, so I'm done trimming. I'm going to set you up here, do a little blowing, and then I'll explain how I do it. Every mulch is different too. A lot of mulches you can't really blow in. The technique is more blowing into the bed as you are blowing out. So you're trying to get the mulch to flip over and cover the old grass up as much as you can but we'll see how this works this is a totally different mulch so let me show you one thing i do is i try to stand back away until i figure out if i can give the, the mulch a little bit more gas and so you got to kind of figure it out It's a little hard to explain, but you have to get the right throttle response and you have to be a safe distance away so you're not actually blowing the mulch all over the place. But that's the after and you can tell there's not been grass in the beds. You can look at it and tell. So I hope that answers some of your questions. It's really got to do with throttle response the type of mulch how long the mulch has been down this mulch is fresh so it's kind of moving around a lot we haven't had any rain go figure yet and uh, so that's how I do it but uh, we got two yards left let's get to the next two I'll get some footage and then I'll uh, tell you about the unfortunate circumstance with Justin so I'll talk to you guys in a bit
Okay guys, so there's the backyard on the house that I filmed for you. Here's the other house that I do. Pretty small yard, but uh, you know, we're done for the day. Um, well, so yesterday after work, let me straighten this up. There we go. Yesterday after work, Justin went home about 10 o'clock last night. He was having really bad pains in his side, and his girlfriend took him to the ER, and they put him through a bunch of pain medication Come to find out, Justin has a kidney stone lodged right outside of the kidney, on the right kidney. And so, he's in quite a lot of pain. <clears throat> no mulching today. Look, we're way behind, but his health and welfare is a little bit more important than a mulch job. I did call the customer. She was absolutely fine she said please tell him that uh, we send our best and he he will probably man it's warm out today he will probably be back either tomorrow which we're supposed to get rain so that's good for him he gets to rest or we'll be back Thursday so he's gonna be fine He's just going through a lot of discomfort and uh, you know, a lot of you guys may have had kidney stones or ladies out there may have had kidney stones. I know I have had one and they don't come out until they're ready to come out, but boy, they cause you a lot of pain. <clears throat> so I hope you guys enjoyed the video. No, Justin did not lose his job. Justin is just in, uh, he's pretty sick. so. Oh, he'll be back and uh, that's it man we're done let me show you the front of this one not too bad not too bad a few stripes believe it or not the grass is starting to dry up but most of these places have irrigation so I'm good there we're just way behind on mulch so all right guys dr reel's been in the house with you as always i'll see you tomorrow peace i'm out